Hello everyone, welcome to ET Studios, and today we're having a look at something really cool on the workshop, and it'll probably introduce itself in a second. Welcome, Cadet. Thank you for enrolling to be a part of the Federal Combat Corporation. Here, we will train you to be the best combat pilot in the galaxy. Or, you will die trying. If you don't want to be the best of the best, then the corporation does not want you here. This facility is a combat simulator, to help you train for upcoming missions. Though, you can still die in this simulator. No rest for the weary, am I right? Feel free to move around the station. When you are ready, go to one of the mission terminal LCD panels to start your training. Good luck out there. That's very cool. Uh, and very well timed music as well. Uh, so, it uh, it talks to you, which is cool. There's lots of cool stuff here. I'll quickly pause over each one so you can read it. Uh, and I am going to do in certain cases. I've read the one on the left. Uh, all ship weapons are disabled within 1.5 kilometers of the station. They will automatically re-enable as soon as you go beyond that distance. You can dock at the docking platforms on the station to refuel hydrogen and recharge batteries. Each player will get to their own GPS location. Nothing happens until you get close uh, of that GPS location. A second player can follow and help, but they will not get any credit for completing the mission. Don't worry, I do have plans for co-op missions. Cool, so I will try this out with someone else once he starts introducing that kind of stuff. Uh, welcome to the combat training facility. This station will help you get started on a journey. This mod is strictly enforcing combat-based missions. Below this deck you'll find four briefing rooms, which all include an LCD and button panel. Step for towards the button panel to begin your first me of many mission briefings. Follow the instructions on the LCD, and if you accept the first training mission, you'll be introduced to the quest log on your HUD. This log can be hidden or revealed at any time by typing forward slash hide mission or forward slash show mission in the global chat as long as you have an active mission. Please keep reading all the other LCD panels for more info and advice about the mod. Uh, hints and advice. Make sure that you have the game sound turned on. Yes. When attacking drones, uh, keep attacking until you see target destroyed. Okay, cool. Uh, it is advised to keep your HUD visible because you might miss mission details, that's a good point. Um, during this training you'll be provided with a ship and ammo. If your ship gets destroyed or if you die and respawn, you'll have to respawn in a new ship. Uh, in doing so, it, I'll tr it'll trigger the mission to start over. You have to complete the mission with using a single ship. If you log back in, it'll trigger a mission restart. Okay. Uh, if you already have a ship and you respawn another, it will remove your previous ship and spawn a new ship. Uh, it will also trigger a mission restart. You will not spawn with any tools or hand weapons, you will obtain those later on. Okay, cool. A uh, very good explanation, I like that. And let's have a look downstairs. Outside is a very cool skybox. It's, it's part of the Space Co Just Got Real mod, so that'll also be linked in the description. There's a planet that looks cool. Um, is that Earth? It is. There's the sun. Okay, so... Cool. I'm assuming each of these. Machine Briefing 1. Is there a training? Nope, this is the training one, I'm assuming. Welcome to the Galactic Combat Training. Aha. Uh -huh. You did a thing. Oh, wow. Welcome to Studios, this is the Galactic Combat Training Space Station. This mission terminal will provide details about combat training as you progress. In the missions, you will unlock additional technology for upgrading your combat ship. To proceed, press button 1 on the panel below. That's very cool. It knows my name. <laughs> that, that's apparently fairly simple to set up, but again, it's very cool considering how this is working, combat training, play connected. It's, and the way that it has scrolling text, etc. is very cool. 
Uh, space combat is a different kind of combat and involves some hand-eye coordination, but mostly consists of thinking outside the box kind of wit. You have to outsmart your opponent rather than outmaneuver them. This first training mission will f first let feel how you'll perform with weapons by giving you some static targets. Then we'll mobilize those targets. Once all of those are taken out, we will send you waves of targets with increasing difficulty. These targets will shoot back. If you feel that you are up to the task, confirm the mission. Hmm. Confirming the mission. A mission panel will appear on your HUD, along with coordinates to the location where you're going to the mission. Remove the mission, yeah. GPS waypoint training one active. There it is. Um, alternatively, you can use. Okay, cool. Use the button panel to bring up your personal craft. Okay. The ship is waiting on the ship bay one. This fighter should be equipped with enough ammo and armor to easily get you through the training mission. If you die or your ship gets destroyed during training, you will have to respawn back here to start this mission. Uh, and to respawn another fighter and try again. Good luck. Cool. Very, very cool. What does this say? Mission bad, ship bay. Okay, cool. I have two minutes to get in my ship. Ship Bay 1, do not land or dock here. To docking platform, to dock. Cool. Wait, can I not just go through the door? Yeah. <laughs> okay. All weapons are disabled. Okay. This is fairly slow. Uh, so hydrogen usage is a thing I have to worry about quite heavily, so I'm not going to use that yet. So this is editing me speaking. Uh, I forget to use hydrogen full stop, which turned out to be a bit of a mistake later on. And I will continue letting my previous self talk. But yeah, use your hydrogen a bit more than I did. The combat training and... Okay, weapons are online, so he has like a little bubble. They were talking about that in the recent uh, stream. Safety bubble. I don't think that's a thing yet. I think he's just managed to do that on his own. But if there's actually been a very cool Q&A stream with a few of the other YouTubers who do space engineers, so I'll link that in the description as well. Wasted Space did a re-upload of that as well, so I'll link that too. Very cool multiplayer stuff coming up, and it's actually very informative about lots of other things as well. What's my reverse thrust like? Is this that standard... I can't remember what it's called. Um, it's a standard ship that comes with the, some of the combat missions Essie gives you. Pretty good ship. Right, let those off. I have no rocket ammo. I have 20,720 bullets in this, which may sound like a lot, but I feel like I'm probably going to fail this pretty miserably, by the way, guys. <laughs> so don't expect anything amazing. Oh, this is quite sluggish. So depending on how long these missions are, I might just do number one, and if you guys want to see more, I'll do the rest as well. Follow-up videos, maybe one video per mission. Okay, slow down. Please, 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 please. Turn around! <laughs> Welcome to your space combat training. We have set up three static drones around you about 500 meters away. We need you to destroy all three drones. You will need to take out both the program and remote control interfaces on these drones, or take out the power. Be careful, these drones have a large explosion radius, so keep your distance. That was very cool. Very loud as well. I hope that... I wasn't talking, so... I hope you guys could... That wasn't too bad on your end. I did turn down the volume slightly. Cool, we have a camera. 
So that's very helpful. Uh, let's try. Wait for the debris to clear. Okay, I don't see a reactor. It's quite a distance away. Trying to conserve ammo. Let's stick to about a thousand bullets per thousand rounds per ship. If I can. Okay, let's take out the weapon system. There we go. Boom. Target destroyed. Okay. Next round. I'm doing it nice and slowly because I need to conserve ammo. This is quite an important task. But let's try some maneuvering as well because that'll probably come into play fairly soon. Try and target the weapons down. Out of range, so it doesn't explode close to us. Done. Did that say no? Target destroyed for the previous one, I think. Boom. So I think he's got warheads in the center. Explode once you destroy certain things. It's got realistic sound on, which is cool. Come on, die. This one. A bit tough. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now, let's see how you react with these drones shooting at you. I am going to deploy three waves of drones, one drone at a time. For a total of three drones per wave. Each wave will be harder than the previous wave. Okay, fair enough. I don't like this shoot back thing. <laughs> okay, he is shooting. Definitely shooting. Come on, come on, come on. You hit, and you hit, and you hit. There we go. It's about that distance. Take out the weapon systems. Ooh. Oh, there's another weapon. Two weapons. Okay, got the weapons. Got the antenna as well. So I'm wasting quite a bit of ammo at this point. Let's have a look at damage. Little bit of armor damage. Oh, the other one's quite close already. a bit easier. Next drawing. I am moving by the way while I'm doing this. Oh, I 
think I got a lucky shot to the reactor there. Okay, so we're on 16,000. Uh, I still haven't activated my hydrogen because I feel like that's going to be a thing. Cool, so we said three raves. This is wave two, so this target will be more difficult than the previous three. an 800 meter range and I need to remember not to waste ammo here. Come on, where's that distance? get the turrets, it's fairly easy. He's a bit close. Good. Okay, I think this is the last one of this wave. Yeah. Okay, place this way so I can get all my ammo facing in that direction. Taking fairly heavy fire now. Check out damage. He's not destroyed yet, so. Hmm. He's taken out quite a bit. No, I wasn't. No. Oh, he's still got a turret. I did not realise he still had a turret. I'm trying to move. Come on, let's move. My hydrogen tank's gone. Okay. Take this guy out. No. Ah, lost my camera. We're gone. <laughs> So I died. Um, huh. Um, okay. I'm going to check how long that recording was and decide whether to continue or not. So I guess that was pretty informative about what actually happens in this. Uh, very, very cool simulation. So, I really, really enjoyed this. It was really, really cool, and um, I definitely want to revisit this. I might do a part two where I have a look at the other missions and talk about it a bit more. My combat skills are 
They can be good, they can be bad. Uh, that last... I didn't realise that thing had a turret and it started shooting at me while I was looking at my ship for damage, so... created more damage. Anyway, this is a very, very cool um, mod world scenario that you can get on the workshop. I'll link it in the description below. Remember to check out that uh, stream to see what the developers are planning with this game in future. It was a very cool stream. Uh, answered a lot of questions from the community, so that was very cool. And I will see you all in the next video. Thank you everyone for watching, and goodbye!